Hey guys, welcome back to Aaron Polo TV. Today we venture into a world unseen by most, teeming with fascinating and unsettling creatures. We're diving deep into the often overlooked realm of worms. Forget your garden variety earthworms, today's subjects are anything but ordinary. From the ocean depths to your backyard, prepare to encounter worms of extraordinary lengths, armed with venomous jaws and peculiar appendages. Get ready to be amazed and perhaps even slightly repulsed as we uncover the top 10 weirdest worms in the world. Are you new in this video? Click subscribe and hit notification bell so let's get started. Our journey begins with the Nemertia, or ribbon worms. These slender creatures, often mistaken for seaweed, lurk in the shallows, their bodies capable of stretching to astonishing lengths. Imagine encountering a worm over 30 meters long, gliding through the water, with hypnotic grace. But don't be fooled by their gentle nature. Concealed within the ribbon worm's body is a proboscis, launched with lightning speed to ensnare prey. Some species inject a paralyzing toxin, while others, like the Gorgonorhynchus, unleash a sticky proboscis that ensnares victims. The diversity of the Nemertia is astounding, from the vibrant hues of the amphipterus to the translucent forms of pelagic species. Despite their strangeness, ribbon worms play a vital role in their ecosystems, controlling populations of smaller invertebrates. Our next encounter takes us to the ocean floor, where the monstrous bobbit worm lies hidden beneath the sand. Lurking within its burrow, only its antennae protruding, the bobbit worm patiently awaits its prey. These ambush predators, reaching lengths of up to 10 feet, are masters of disguise. When an unsuspecting fish or crab wanders too close, the bobbit worm strikes, its powerful jaws snapping shut with incredible force. These jaws, equipped with sharp mandibles, can easily slice a fish in half. The bobbit worm's bite is not only powerful, but also venomous, paralyzing its prey. It's a chilling reminder that even in the ocean's depths, danger can lurk in the most unexpected places. Prepare to be captivated by the bloodworm, a creature whose very lifeblood runs crimson. Found in shallow, muddy environments, these worms are easily recognizable by their vibrant red coloration, a result of their unique copper-based blood. But don't let their beauty fool you. The bloodworm possesses venomous jaws. These retractable jaws deliver a painful sting, injecting venom that can cause irritation and even paralysis in smaller prey. Despite their fearsome reputation, Bloodworms play a vital role in their ecosystems, serving as a crucial food source and helping to oxygenate the sediment. So while they may be a bit creepy, bloodworms are essential to the balance of life in aquatic ecosystems. Bristleworm, the itchy touch of the sea. Our exploration now takes us to coral reefs where danger lurks in the form of the bristleworm. These segmented creatures, often adorned with vibrant colors, are a common sight on reefs. But beneath their alluring exterior lies a painful secret bristles. These stiff, hair-like structures are a formidable defense mechanism, capable of inflicting a painful sting. Imagine reaching out to touch a beautiful worm, only to recoil in pain as its bristles pierce your skin, leaving an itchy, burning rash. Some species possess bristles that break off upon contact, embedding themselves in the skin. Bristle worms are opportunistic feeders, using their bristles to snare small invertebrates and even fish. The bristles act like tiny harpoons, impaling prey and dragging it towards the worm's mouth. King Ragworm, the monarch of the mudflats. Our journey takes us to the intertidal zone, where the ocean meets the land. Here, amidst the mudflats and rocky shores, reigns the King Ragworm. Growing up to a meter in length, this impressive creature is a sight to behold. Its segmented body, adorned with colorful bristles, allows it to navigate the challenging terrain. The king ragworm is a voracious predator, equipped with powerful jaws lined with sharp teeth. These jaws can crush the shells of mollusks and crustaceans, its primary food source. The king ragworm is a keystone species, playing a vital role in maintaining the health of its ecosystem. Its burrowing activity oxygenates the sediment, creating a more hospitable environment for other organisms. As a top predator, it helps control populations of its prey, preventing any one species from dominating the ecosystem.
leeches the bloodsuckers of lore and legend. Few creatures evoke such visceral reactions as the leech. Found in freshwater habitats, leeches are easily recognizable by their flattened, segmented bodies, equipped with suckers at both ends. These suckers, working with powerful muscles, allow the leech to move with surprising agility. Imagine wading through a shallow pond, only to feel a slight tugging sensation and see a leech, its body engorged with your blood. While the thought of leeches feasting on our blood might send shivers down our spines, not all leeches are bloodsuckers. Many species are scavengers, feeding on dead animals and organic matter. Even bloodsucking leeches play a vital role in their ecosystems, helping to control populations of their prey. Their ability to painlessly slice through skin with razor-sharp teeth, combined with their natural anticoagulant, made them invaluable in medieval medicine. Today, leeches are used in reconstructive surgery to stimulate blood flow and promote healing. Velvet Worm, the soft touch of a silent hunter. Our journey now takes us to humid tropical forests, where the velvet worm hides amongst decaying leaves. These ancient invertebrates, often described as living fossils, have remained relatively unchanged for millions of years. Covered in a soft, velvety skin, these worms are a world away from the slimy creatures we often associate with worms. Their bodies, supported by a hydrostatic skeleton, give them a unique, fluid movement. But don't be fooled by their gentle nature. The velvet worm is a skilled hunter, equipped with a secret weapon slime. Hidden within its body are glands that produce a sticky, quick-hardening slime, which it ejects with surprising force. The velvet worm then approaches its helpless prey, injecting a paralyzing saliva with its sharp mandibles. Scientists are studying its slime for potential applications in adhesives and wound healing. Squidworm, the alien of the abyss. Our exploration now takes us to the ocean depths, where sunlight fades and pressure reigns supreme. Here lives a creature so bizarre, it seems to defy classification, the squidworm. Discovered in 2007, this deep-sea dweller captivated the world with its unique appearance. Imagine a worm with ten tentacle-like appendages, each longer than its body, swaying in the currents. These appendages, covered in sensory organs, allow the squid worm to navigate the pitch-black environment and detect prey. The squid worm uses its palps to capture marine snow, a constant rain of organic detritus falling from the surface. Its translucent body reveals a complex network of internal organs, glowing with an otherworldly luminescence. The Pigbutt Worm, a misnomer of the deep. Prepare to be both amused and slightly disgusted as we delve into the world of the Pigbutt Worm. Discovered in 2007 off the coast of California, this deep-sea dweller quickly captured the internet's attention. Imagine a worm, no bigger than a hazelnut, with a plump, rounded body and a peculiar appendage resembling a pig's rear end. This fleshy protuberance is actually the worm's posterior end, used to anchor itself to the seabed. The pig butt worm plays a vital role in its deep sea ecosystem, feeding on decaying organic matter. It helps recycle nutrients back into the food web, maintaining the balance of its environment. So, the next time you hear the name pig butt worm, remember its crucial role in the deep sea ecosystem. Zombie Worms, Bone Eaters of the Deep Our final descent takes us to the deepest ocean corners, where a macabre spectacle unfolds, a whale fall. Here, the zombie worm, or Ocidax, thrives by burrowing into the bones of dead whales. Lacking a mouth and digestive system, the zombie worm uses root-like structures to extract nutrients. These structures host symbiotic bacteria, which help break down the bone's proteins and fats. The discovery of the zombie worm in 2002 revolutionized our understanding of whale falls, revealing a complex ecosystem. The zombie worm plays a crucial role in breaking down the whale's skeleton, releasing nutrients back into the ecosystem. From slime-slinging velvet worms to bone-devouring zombie worms, we've journeyed through a world of bizarre and fascinating creatures. These invertebrates play vital roles in their ecosystems reminding us that even the smallest creatures have a part to play in nature's balance. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed learning about these bizarre worms, make sure to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more fascinating content. See you next time.